I do feel like something's missing though. Like it needs to be a bit more, it needs to be a bit more really Eilish themed. Like. How are we doing? Oh, I'm so happy to be here right now. We're gonna have some fun. Amazing beauty, bueno. This is Billy. Well, not the Billy, but close enough. I'm a very huge fan of Billy Eilish. She's an absolute legend in her field. Her lyrics are out of the world. I think she was named one of like the top lyricists of the decade. The point is, she's an amazing artist, singer, lyricist. She is, in every sense of the word, magical. But one thing that I don't think she anticipated on becoming was an absolute hair legend. Billie Eilish has had one of the most versatile collection of hairstyles out of most artists. I feel like I've created like a decent combination of hair colors, hair choices through the years, but Billie Eilish still tops them. My absolute favorite Billie Eilish hair moment was her iconic green root black hair moment. It featured a color that few people would have the literal balls to try and she just straight up rocked it. I've done actually a very, very similar look to that previously a couple of years prior. It was an absolute freaking look and I will never forget it. But I've done the roots and black thing moment. However, for the past few weeks, I have been toying with the idea of creating a hair look or a hair phenomena where the hair color is outlined with a darker rendition of the same color. That's creating a very graphic, very pop art, very almost cartoon-like addition of a hair color. This is the first one that I tried. This is where Billy comes in. I have this wig and she is absolutely sunner. She is 100% human hair, 1B hair color. She is fully one length because I just cut it one length. And I'm going to do a vibrant neon green outline surrounding the entire perimeter of the hair. Inspired by the queen, Billie Eilish. Duh, let's mix up the bleach. I could have gone ahead and just Got in a blonde wig and dyed it black and green. And I wouldn't have had to bleach it. But black is a very tricky color to mix with other colors. You are 100% going to cause bleeding. It makes a lot more sense to start on an already black base and just bleach out what you need to do. 30 volume, Schwarzkopf, obviously. So I am really hoping that this idea that I have will turn out well and that I'll create a pretty iconic, Billy approved hair color. And hopefully we'll start a new trend of color outlining. <laughs> I'm normally such an incredibly messy hairstylist. I'm going to try super hard this video to not do that, especially because I'm wearing a, a dress that my mom gave me and I, I, I literally wore it today for the first time. I'm actually going to be starting from the front because that is the one that I want to be able to control. I'm looking for probably to have about an inch of green going all around the perimeter of the hair. I think it'll look sick.
front section is done, now it's time to move on to the back. Once again, I'm looking to do around an inch long. The key over here is to really saturate the hair because I am not going to be combing this out, I'm not going to be doing anything to this other than letting it chill inside the foil. There we are. I dropped bleach blobs all over my chair and I didn't realize how stained my chair was. I wonder what the floor will turn out like. Let's check if they're ready. Does this look cool or what? The front is definitely lighter, I think, than the rest of the hair, obviously, because I started with it, which to me, I'm fine with, because it just means it's going to be brighter around the face. I'm definitely seeing that there is a bit of inconsistencies over here, and that's not really something that I could have prevented. Because this is a wig, I have no idea what origin of hair this is. In fact, there's probably a mix of it. And I also have no idea if this was dyed, if there's any products on there. I'm gonna go rinse this off and then see what we're left with. But I'm excited. I have high hopes. So I'm going to be using this as my reference. Ooh, it matches my nails, nice. She did keep redoing this look for quite a while, so the color did kind of shift. But I think this is going to be the one I'm going to be following. Kind of very apple green, very much my nails. Because the color is so light and I genuinely do not have a pastel green, I'm going to be starting with a white base conditioner, hair mask. I'm using silk hair repair mask. I have these two from Kune. You might be wondering why I have yellow here with me, but this is way too dark and it's a kind of bit bluey. Her hair was kind of a very true green. It's like very lime apple, green apple, lime green. So it definitely has some warmth to it. It's a very mellow green. This isn't what we're going for at all. Boo. I'm gonna start with this one called Green Juice by Bleach London. Not really what I'm after. Twisted Lemon. I just matched the inside of the ball which now makes it very hard to understand what the color actually is, but I think it's not correct. I'm gonna put in a tiny bit of my favorite, the Phantom Green. This. Okay, I darkened it and also muted it, which isn't really the goal. Okay, I added a tiny bit of blue to it and now we're kind of brighter. I think I did it. I also think this is the best I'm gonna get. So I'm gonna stop here and apply this to the hair. Okay, so even with the bleach left on for like 45 minutes and being bleached at 30 volume developer, the best that this hair lifted to was like a level seven. I'm going to change track a bit over here. This bottom piece could remain like this, it's no problem. I'm going to move over to the front because the front here is actually quite a bit lighter because we started it way earlier. Back to the back. This over here contains quite a bit of gold and what happens because of color theory when you have green and you add it onto gold, it's going to turn pretty much to the color of mud 
khaki off-road terrain it's gonna kind of look like that so we need to cancel some of this yellow out so that the green can pop arctic fox aquamarine you can see now the green is a lot colder in color cool so now i'm gonna apply this to the rest of the hair here Great. Gagging over this wig. Better outfit. I didn't even glue this wig down because I think I can get away with it. Gagging. I gave it a very kind of 90s blowout moment because I really wanted to have the green of the ends pop it's giving Billie Eilish giving Shigo from Kim Possible it's giving what's the one from the Powerpuff Girls not Bubbles <sighs> Buttercup it's giving rich girl with style <laughs> I've got neither of those things but it's giving it it is portraying that. I could not be more happy with this Billie Eilish inspired wig. It is giving everything. It's like the green money piece should become a trend. And green tipped hair. Okay, so what I did not tell you guys is that there is a Billie Eilish concert tomorrow in the UK. <laughs> so I just booked flights um, and very, very quick accommodations because uh, I want to go see her. All right, let's go. Let's go meet Billy. Meet might be a bit uh, <laughs> hopeful, optimistic, over the moon. Seven twenty-nine. I head off the concert this evening, and I am fully dressed for it. Like I, I, full shebang. You ready for it? Yeah, baby, you have to look a bit more enthusiastic. Is this in the front? What's the party in the back? I don't really do oh. Today, this morning, I didn't do it, but she, someone told her very nice hair. So I'm assuming it was her own. It's not. It's a wig. We're lucky that the passport people did it. Because they do it. They do it so often. They're like they hold the passports up. They look at me. They're like, can you wear your mask? And they're like, can you wear your mask? And they're like, scrutinize me for a few minutes. Bye. Thank you. Now go and meet the Queen of England, also known as Billy Eilish. I will take you. Place. Let's go see the Queen! There's a gondola outside the room. I didn't know there's a gondola in there. We're gonna catch that to go to the O2. Let's go! That girl already has a better outfit than I do. Entrance fee. Dye my hair that color. Let's go. I'm so happy to be here right now. We're gonna have some fun!
All the products used are going to be down in the description box below as they always are and you can check out all of my previous videos <laughs> that are filmed as well as my merch i added some beautiful brand new stuff so you can check them out right now okay i need to go and continue enjoying this very wild trip um uh, i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you give it a go and i will see you in my next video